Hi, this is Dr. Proactive Randy Gilbert, producer of InsideSuccessRadio.com, and I invite you to take a moment and listen to this powerful interview segment so you can be more proactive and successful. Let's return to the path to triumph with the Inside Success Show. Welcome back to the Inside Business Success Show. This is Jan Schleicher, and we're sharing inside success secrets from Tim Knox, entrepreneur, author, speaker, and radio host. You can check out his website by going to www.timknox.com. All right, Tim, let's, I just can't wait to get into this. <laughs> We are going to focus on marketing today um, because, really, you've done so many creative things with marketing, but I know our listeners are curious, and you kind of briefly touched on this, but, but share with us some insight about how your mama taught you everything you know about business. <laughs> you know, that's, that's the big question I get wherever I go now is, what, yeah. what did your mama teach you? Uh, yeah. It, it, it's kind of funny. Again, my mama uh, just turned 80 years old has more energy than you and I put together. She is just, and she thinks this book is the greatest thing in the world, Jan. I actually had her at a book signing. Oh, I love it. it you know, it was so wonderful. I mean, here's this little old country lady, very shy <laughs> normally, not a real outgoing person, and people were asking her to sign their books. And she oh, looked yeah. at me, she actually said, are we supposed to write in these books? <laughs> and I said, yeah, Mom, I think you can write it. And what was so funny is, you know, I have this big flourishing signature. She would write her name really small and very <laughs> meticulous, like she was writing a check. Uh, so <laughs> I'm just, uh, you know, I, if, if I don't sell another book, just that, seeing her there was just amazing. But, you know, here's, here's what I learned from this woman. Again, she was not an entrepreneur. She had never spent a day in business. She was... Uh, again, uh, taken out of school in, in the fifth grade to cook for her dad and her brothers. Uh, she worked in the cotton field, married very young, uh, as was the habit in, in Alabama. This was, again, in the 1940s and 50s. Um, mm-hmm. But, you know, she has what Nito Cobain says it best. His mama, he would put his mama up against uh, 100 MBAs because she has a degree in common sense. And yeah. so what, you know, the things that she taught me were things like, uh, again, goal setting. You know, she was very big on, on setting a goal. She instilled this in all of her children. She didn't want us just bouncing around in life. Uh, and that's something I use in my business every day. If I'm going to launch a new product or start a new part of my business, I very clearly map it out. I have that destination. Uh, she taught me a lot about personal responsibility, which are two words that a lot of people don't understand. You know, being, yes. being responsible for yourself. You're not put on this earth to have a, to get handouts. You're here to do do good works. Uh, so be responsible for yourself. Don't rely on others. That's the biggest thing that has made me successful, Jan, is the fact that I have never relied on anyone for anything. I always go out, do it, make it happen. And I know we're going to talk a lot about marketing, and this is one of the reasons why I'm such a great marketer is because I'm not afraid to ask. I'm not afraid to go after it. So we'll get more in-depth on that. But, you know, other things like, you know, opportunity. You know, everybody sits around saying, well, I'm just going to wait for opportunity to knock at my door. I'm going to wait for my ship to come in. Well, I hate to yeah. tell you this, but many people have died of old age standing on that dock waiting for that ship to come in. You know, yeah. opportunity doesn't knock. Opportunity doesn't even know where you live. <laughs> you know, yeah. it's not delivered like pizza. You're not going to hear a knock at the door and open the door and there's a pimply-faced teenager with a box full of hot opportunity for you. It doesn't work. Yeah. You know, my mama taught me you got to get off the couch, you got to open that door and run up and down the street, and you got to knock on doors. And maybe opportunity might answer one of those, those doors. So that was another thing she taught me, very, very important, very early on, don't sit around and wait for opportunity to come to you. You've got to be a seeker of opportunity. And, you know, another thing she taught me that I use more than anything, Jan, is she taught me you've got to learn to laugh. You know, not yeah. laugh at others, but laugh at yourself. Laugh at your circumstances, because life is pretty darn funny, you know. Yeah. I, I, think, I, I can see humor in just about everything. And yeah. that ability 
has really pulled me out of some fires over the years. Just the ability to yeah. kind of step back and laugh. And I talk about this in the book. I mean, this was a lesson I learned uh, after being almost electrocuted to death by my dad, uh, who thought it was funny. Uh, so it was kind of a hard <laughs> lesson to, to, to learn. Yeah. But, you know, humor and laughter is such a big, important part. And unfortunately, there's just not enough humor in the world. So, you know, little yeah. things like that that just were instilled in my personality very early on that trained Hi, this is Dr. Proactive Randy Gilbert. Thank you for listening to InsideSuccessRadio.com. Now I want to invite you to listen to this entire interview for free. All you have to do to get VIP access is to type in the link as you see it below. In addition to this powerful interview, you'll be able to hear many other of your favorite celebrities such as Jack Canfield, Mark Victor Hansen, Robert Allen, Zig Ziglar, and dozens of others. Plus, there are thousands of dollars in valuable bonus gifts just waiting.